Ciao bang. That means hello in Vietnamese. I'm Robert N. Maycumber, author of the Honor Series of Historical Fiction. Here we are at Serenity Bungalow on Matlache Island on the lower Gulf Coast of Florida. This is where I live and do most of my work. You know, I travel the world to research and write my novels, but I love coming home. My work is pretty unique because I have a great subject matter. I write about an American naval intelligence officer from 1863 to 1908. He had a great career. It started in the Civil War in these islands and in the Caribbean, and it went all around the world. He gets to be involved in some very momentous events, some exotic locales, and some very exciting adventures. I am also very blessed to have the greatest readership an author could hope for. Fans in 10 countries look forward every year to my newest novel. They spread the word and they give me support to keep on doing what I love doing, taking my readers around the world and illuminating history through my novels. And speaking of my novels, here's the newest one, The Honored Dead. The Honored Dead is set in 1883 French Indochina, Southeast Asia. Peter Wake is on the Mekong River in the mangrove jungles with a very simple mission, at least it sounded simple in Washington. Go up the river, find the King of Cambodia, and deliver a secret message from the President of the United States. But six months later, what seems simple in Washington turns out to be very complicated in Southeast Asia because Peter Wake is still there. After having nearly died at the hands of opium warlords, Chinese Malay pirates, and French gangsters, he's exhausted, frustrated, and wounded. And he now knows that nothing is simple in Cambodia and Vietnam. This story illuminates the beginning of a bloody clash that lasted a hundred years in Southeast Asia. A bloody clash that began with each side determined to avenge their honored dead. Uh -huh, but there's more to this novel. You see, after the first six novels of the honor series have garnered the highest state, regional, and national awards, including, I'm very proud to say, the American Library Association's 2008 National Boyd Award for Literary Excellence. Something new has happened with the honor series. It's even more exciting than ever. Now, I'm not at liberty to divulge the details, especially not before you read the novel. But I can tell you that in 2007, there was a strange discovery in Key West off the coast of Florida. This discovery has led to an exciting surprise in the honored dead, and a mystery that may take years to solve. And so, my friends, with the honored dead, Peter Wake's avid fans around the world have another mission to work, another journey to make, and another mystery to solve. Onward and upward.